Hello everybody and welcome back to Dark Souls 3. Johnny here. I've had a great day today. You know one of those days where you solve a puzzle you've been working on for days. Work as a software engineer. Hopefully that makes more sense now. So I hope you're having a great day too. Today we're doing the boss of the area here. But first let's explore this little corner. I remember there being some pretty sweet loot in here. Maybe even a titanite slab, I want to say. Which is the material we need to level up to maximum our weapons. Praise the sun. Right on. Estus shard. Alright, we'll take it. The more the merrier. There are enemies here, so we're gonna keep our guard up. Oh. Okay. So that is something that's happening. Three giant enemies. Hopefully we can kind of reach a compromise. Lure one of you guys down here. So these are the fatties from before, but they now have wings. Let's not get hit by that, shall we? Okay, not so good. Heal up here. Maybe not a good healing time. Okay. I think it's safe to heal here. Yeah. We can't block against that? I think we got you. Yeah, we got you. No drops? Oh, large titanite. We'll take it. Next. Oh, right there. I think this one's a little different. Yeah, he's got, he's got hammers. He hammered us. <laughs> oh, th those are actually axes? Pretty cool enemies. Pretty cool enemies. That's okay. We'll, we'll go back up there. I don't know if they respawn or not, but we'll deal with them. Hopefully we sent the elevator. Yeah, we sent it back down. Let's go. So after we kill those guys, I think we get a titanite slab. Could be wrong about that. If we do, we might want to go back and level up our weapon. If we don't, we'll go into the boss. And then we'll be done with this area. Hopefully, the boss won't be too difficult. Hold on. What am I missing here? Oh, that way. Yeah. But I said that about a couple bosses already in this run. And they've taken way more effort than expected, so... Let's give them the, the respect they deserve, shall we? The second phase of the boss is pretty tough. I remember that quite distinctly, actually. So if we go straight in here, is that gonna be better for us? It looks like all three of them spawn. Which is... Suboptimal. I don't want to fight you here. Let me take you to over here. Oh yeah, and grab our souls. We actually have a hefty amount of souls. 
Um, hello, sir. You with the axes over here. One of the things I hate is when you press the lock on button and it resets the camera instead of, well, locking on. It is terrible. Because it, it resets your view. Dude, you gotta get some distance and heal. Okay. Ooh. The game was very generous with that backslash or about backstab. Didn't think we had that. Alright. One fatty down, two to go. Oh. Excuse me, sir. Mind following me over here. Oh. Nice dodges. Yeah, it's just through here, sir. No, excuse me, it's just through here. I was a little bit too excited. Ooh, you. How many attacks can you... Okay, heal up. You got some pretty cool attacks. I'll give you that. Oh, you got staggered, huh? That's you down. Lots of titanite. I think we want to level up another weapon, man. Have like access to a, a different move set. Might behoove us to to have options, because when it comes to the DLC, I have no idea what we're gonna encounter. And so I really want to have some different options here. Yo, you gotta stop doing that. time there if I do say so myself Whoa. nice get back wrecked and mm, back wrecked I think I just came up with that titanite slab let's go titanite chunk very positive all of it super worth it and there's more uh, lootage up here what do we have? Oh. Wait, what? Oh, you dropped down here. Wasn't there also a way up? Would I be right in saying that? I thought there was a way to go all the way up there. Let me have a quick run around here. Make sure I'm not screwing up. Oh yeah, there's a an evident staircase that leads you up pretty simple stuff you run around make sure there's no loot that you're missing so here's just uh, a way to drop down ooh nope it doesn't seem like a very practical thing to to build I don't know why they built that little entry there take the ladder up Just some loot. Hunter's ring. What is that? That is increases dexterity. Yes. We will use that. We are up to 42 dexterity. Nice. That's fantastic. Let's just drop down here. Uh, we can actually drop here. That's okay. We're going to take some damage, but... So we're actually going to explore a little bit. We can drop. Make sure we're, we're dropping onto something. But yeah. Okay. Luckily they, they can't hit us from there. What, what do you do here though? Do you drop down to the... Uh, to the thing? Well, it seems... Seems safe. 
Oh, I think we screwed up. We should have dropped there. Oh, no, never mind. You can actually drop here. Divine Pillars of Light. Oh, no idea what that is. Uh, that guy is just gonna keep shooting at us. Seriously. Uh, okay, let's grab that loot over there. Blessed gem. Isn't it weird how some people say blessed and some people say blessed? It seems like they, they say it under different circumstances as well. Like sometimes they will say blessed versus saying blessed. I don't know. As someone who's not native to the to the language, I've always found that kind of thing confusing. So, you are now down. Let's take a look around and make sure we're not missing anything here, because I I think we might might be missing something. There is a ladder, actually. Who? Cool. What do we have? Oh! Are you a mimic? They are not mimics. Divine Blessing. And Twinkling Titanite. What was Divine Blessing? Remind me. Fully restores HP and cures ailments. Positive. You know, I've never actually ever used that item. But it is good. Or useful, at least. Ooh. That's nice. Twinkling Titanite. Oh, there. Oh yeah, we're back to here. I I get I get it. So, you know what? Let's go hit the bonfire. Oh shit. Wrong way, wrong way. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Ouch. Alright, so I'm gonna go level up and get ready for the boss. I'll meet you there in a sec. Alright, I'm ready to roll. We're gonna take a an attempt at the boss. I've upgraded our Hollow Slayer sword to the max. Look at this. Over 500 damage a pop. It's gonna serve us real good. My thinking was as as good as the damage is from the great sword. I can't really use it in every fight because it's too slow sometimes. And also, a lot of the time I can't wield it because it's too heavy. So my thinking was, the Hollow Slayer sword is kind of the the balance right now does way more damage than the katana while still being quite light and quick for a great sword oh didn't see you there buddy on the side yeah that's what i thought i also upgraded my shield because why not oh did not get the poke okay that's fine Please, sir, knight, don't attack me now. Or if you're gonna, then attack me now, but... Don't stand halfway there. Oh my god, this is so aggravating. Okay. You know what? That's okay. You rush this guy. One bitch is down. You go back. Reset. Don't... No. Not like that. Get all the way back. Heal. And you do it again. You go on another run. Whoa. Now maybe we can get both of you. That would be fantastic. We're one-shotting those guys, which is great. Like, I can deal with you guys in my sleep. Hopefully. Oh, 
and you get guard broken. So yeah, I'm thinking I'm gonna take like a, a pike weapon and upgrade it for the DLC because I think it will come in handy to have a, a long range poking weapon. Excuse me, sir. Get comboed. You just got comboed. Ooh, we got... Excuse me, we have three more knights to fight. Uh, if you say so. Seems excessive, in my humble opinion, but... I am not Miyazaki. That's not abundantly clear. Get combo. Dude, we're rolling. With the Hollow Slayer Sword, we're absolutely rolling here. Now, here's where it's uh, a little bit tricky. Because we're dealing with two guys. The extra stamina is serving us really well, dude. Okay, run back. Without getting hit, ideally. Um, I'm almost tempted to wait out the, the buff on his weapon because... Or now we have an opening because he's coming for us alone. I think we got him. Yes. Dude, we're doing great at, against these guys. Like, let me remind you, we've died to them like on a one versus one. Several times. Maybe not several times, but a number of times. Get oh. Lots of large titanite. I like that the game does this because it starts to throw these materials at you, kind of saying, hey, you can now experiment with lots of different weapons before committing to one. So that is the boss. But before we go there, there's a little shortcut here that we can unlock. And we're gonna do just that. You'll see where this connects back to. It's, it's really fascinating. One of those beautiful things about these games where things interconnect and that realization of, oh, this connects back to here. Look at that, Lothar Castle. All the way back to Lothar Castle. Wasn't there, I'm a, okay, here is where I'm like, wasn't there a bonfire? But we can still use the boss bonfire, that's not too bad. I do think I'm missing like a hidden bonfire in that room. I have the chip on my shoulder there. So we're gonna take a stab at the boss. How many attempts will it take? I don't know. But if we can't get it today, I'm, I'm not gonna be ashamed. You know, I think it, it's still a good episode as it is. We've made good progress. We've upgraded our weapon to the max. We've cleared that little side area as well. Pretty much we cleared the entire archives area. We didn't skip anything. So we'll take a look at the boss and honestly, I'm gonna be a happy camper even if we can't get him. Maybe let's wait for that guy to to roll past. And we're... Yeah. Looks like there's an easy route to the boss. We have to retry him several times. That's always good. It's an interesting one. I mean, most bosses are really. One of the strengths of the game is that the bosses are pretty cool. Oh dear. Another dogged contender. Dogged? That's a nice word. Welcome, unkindled one. Purloiner of cinders. Mind you, the mantle of Lord interests me none. The fire-linking curse. The legacy of Lords. Let it all fade into nothing. 
You've done quite enough. Now have your rest. It looks cool, man. Even if we get owned by him, it looks really cool. Whoa! Look at that. He teleports! Whoa. Can we heal? Save him? Kind of. It's not a safe attack. Whoa! I thought the fire was gonna get us. Whoa. Too fast for me. Okay. Don't. This spot marks our grave. But you may rest here too. That was really painful. I thought I could get away with a heal there. God damn it. All right. Well, the run to the boss is not very long, so we're going to give it another attempt today. I think I think we deserve it. I think uh, we owe it to ourselves. In all fairness, it doesn't seem that hard to predict his attacks. So maybe we'll get him. Although I remember the second phase was quite a bit harder. We'll see, we'll see what happens. Yeah. Either way, I think we're making good progress, really. Uh, we're running on what what is this episode 30 something and we we basically beat the game essentially or really close not oh okay let's not start off like this guy and a heal <laughs> ah stop stop Okay. I have guarded against your attack. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Roll too soon. Woo. Uh. Trade hits. Oh, get wrecked. Get healed upon. Very nice. Not nice. But you're fine. Nice dodge. Keep sneaking in the attacks. Dude, he's done so. Heal. Oh shit. I had to block with the shield there. Oh, too slow. Wow, how did I not die there? Oh yeah, okay. Second phase. I can't remember actually what, what it was. Yeah. Oh, she comes into play. Brother. I'm on my way. Why didn't my she brother. join earlier? Was she busy? I'm yielding sword of like, Lothric. Sprint. Were you too busy brooding over there on that altar? Rise if you were. Questions. For that is our curse. I will rid you of your curse. Eventually, maybe not in this attempt. It 
It's a cool boss. I like it. <laughs> it looks really cool. Uh, I cannot see you though. Is the thing. This spot marks our grave, but you may rest here too, if you like. So much for the second phase. Alright, well as promised we will leave it here, I hope you enjoyed the episode, let me know down below if you did, and as always, thanks for watching, catch you next time.